All right, everybody ready back here? No, no problem. Athletes from Hawaii, and we'll start with an opening statement from the head coach and then open it to questions for everyone. Okay, well, first of all, it's awesome to be back here in Oregon. Uh, we love playing here, it's an awesome facility, the staff is awesome. So, first off, uh, two, happy, excited, uh, proud of these guys coming back after that first set. Um, <clears throat> I was also, you know, they just kept fighting and playing hard, and uh, yeah, just good match, and just happy that we came out on top. Questions? Yeah, my or, uh, Coach, just start with, um, what do you think kind of was the turning point for you guys? You know, you won the first couple of points, and then they took the first set, and they were up, I think, halfway through the second set. But what, where did things kind of start to change in your favor, do you think? Uh, well, I think the first set, I don't know if it was jitters. <laughs> Maybe jitters. I don't know. Uh, we just just have to keep. We just have to keep going. And I think uh, making the subs uh, in that second set just to give, you know, give some of the, the starters some chance to just take a breather, come outside, reflect on the game just a little bit, reset a little bit. Um, I think all the people that came off the bench did an awesome job. You know, even if it was a couple points for you know serving here and there, and some defense here and there. Um, I think Tally came in with a whole bunch of energy this whole year. She's been a little spark plug every time she came in. Uh, and then if we just do our job a little bit more, you know, on blocking, maybe. Send the ball a little bit higher. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, I think that all of that just kind of clicked in. And them just growling and just going after balls. And just yeah, staying in the play. I just keep telling them, stay in the play. That's a big block on the other side. We're going to get blocked. We just gotta keep, make sure we cover and just keep playing. Um, yeah. <clears throat> Amber, uh, just looking at the numbers, that's 13 blocks for you guys tonight. The block's kind of really been working the last couple of weeks. Why is this block you guys are doing right now maybe different than say three, three, four weeks ago in the season? Um, uh, lots of practice. I feel like um, the coaches definitely gave us. Um, I don't know, just good, good stations in practice, and um, we're watching it, it, it. It's credit to like the film sessions as, as well, and yeah, just more of a um, system. And I think we're definitely, um, we're definitely executing that a little bit more. There's definitely um, some improvements, obviously, but I think compared to our first game of the season, we our numbers are probably like triple this, so it's really good. I mean, our numbers right now are triple what we had first game, so. Go to the back here. Uh, Kate, you're to looking at that first set, it'd be easy to say Amber wasn't getting chances and kills, and that was part of the reason why I was able to get up as quickly as they would. It, was it more than that? Um, I think that the first set, we, we talked about it afterwards, I think the first set was just not our style of volleyball, period. I don't think it really had to do with like just one person not being a part of the game. I think that it, I think it, you know, having everybody apart and having our flow is when everyone's running and everyone's slotting. So I, I mean, it would be it's wonderful to get my middles involved and especially Amber. But I think that it was just a whole team flow type of situation. But we were able to get it back in the second second set. So what would you point to as far as like something that got that flow going? I mean, obviously it's a lot of things, but uh, oh, maybe yeah. a couple of. Them. I think it's all just. I mean, we talk about it as a team. Like every our bread and butter is serving and receiving. So. Just like getting our passing and being more aggressive behind the service line is really important to our team. So we were able to do that in the second set. Coach, just how big of an advantage is it that you guys have already played Oregon this season when it's such a quick turnaround from the first round to the second round? Big advantage. Yeah, they came played us. I, I think it's it's an advantage because we both played each other already. We kind of know, you know, what's, you know, what's going to happen if, if you know, that turns out to be, we were playing Oregon. Uh, yeah. yeah. I'm just happy that this game, this first game, and I will just look at, look and watch this next game and, you know, see who comes out on top. Coach, you uh, kind of substitute a little bit behind the service line tonight that we maybe haven't seen recently. Just kind of was wondering what 
what the thought process behind is getting some some of the other girls specifically uh, serving. Yeah, we we have to be aggressive on serving. You know, the serve pass game. We got to make sure we we're passing balls. You know, obviously. The height differences, you know, I, you know, as you go in advance, this is different from our team. Uh, we got to make sure that I just quote them, and I'm like, I rock back. I'm like, we can't serve lollipops. Lollipops will get like all three big hitters coming at us, and go ahead and try and defend. You know, and we have girls that are on the bench that can serve good. You know, they have aggressive serves, which you guys saw. You know, I subbed them in, and it just kind of changes the game a little bit. So. Coach, you're just talking about how there's some familiarity with Oregon. Conversely, how much of the challenge in the first set was a team that you're not familiar with and just you kind of seeing what they do present and kind of making adjustments? Yeah. So in the last, I would say in the last four, the four matches we played before we got here, uh, it's like Long Beach and then we played Cal Poly and Long Beach again. It's like all fast, not so high. The balls are not so it's like kind of right on the tape, just changing mindset on like going low and quick over versus this is a little bit higher. Still got some speed. We got some higher, you know, girls touching a little bit higher on the ball. Just making sure we just kind of, it's kind of like ours, you know, just a little bit higher. But just def definitely a different speed that we just can and play it against. We're just zoom here, zoom here, you know, quick, 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 quick. Now it's just a middle, a little bit higher on the pins, a little up here, like different on um, range uh, where they're hitting the ball. Yeah. Anything else? Yeah, go ahead. Just not for me, Amber. Um, you guys come back after that first set and just kind of wondering now, um, <coughs> where is the confidence level of this team? Because there were a couple of matches this year where you guys kind of you know, struggled a little bit after you fell behind, but this one, you came roaring back. Just where is the confidence level of this team right now? Yeah, um, I would say, um, like we said before, I think collectively that, was, that wasn't us um, as a team that first set and then just individually, um, I didn't put my uh, best um, set in the first set as well. Like I was slow to start. And so um, I give credit to the confidence coming from our teammates because my teammates um, talked to me. Um, Coach Rob uh, pulled me aside and talked to me too. And I think collectively um, we talked to each other and that confidence, we trusted each other and then we came out on top. So we could have folded obviously after the first set, but um, that wouldn't have done any good because I don't know. I think it was, I give credit to the team and coaches for that, so. Anything else for Hawaii? One last one for me. Uh, Kate, just uh, looking at tomorrow, one team you're more familiar with than the other. Can you just speak to the different challenges as far as, you know, who you're going to see? Yeah, I think that, um you know, this, this, our team is very, like a big word for us is humility and just knowing that we have to come into the gym every day with our 100% and knowing that we're going to always go hard and go for balls. And I think that that's just something else that we have to bring today. Um, I mean, tomorrow, sorry. Um, so yeah, I think that's just going to be, that's always something that we focus on and it's going to stay the same for tomorrow. <coughs> it's about playing our side volleyball. Every team that we're going to look, look for on the other side are going to be different than we, you know. I mean, obviously, between both of them, we saw Oregon already, but it's always going to come down to what you can do on your side. Um, and you just kind of got to scout for the, the rest of it. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate Thank it. You. Thanks, guys. Can I take this water with me? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> 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 <laughs>